Hello everyone! Welcome to Teacher Frail TV! Our subject is Math 4, Quarter 1, Week 4, Milk Base. Let's learn about Multiplying mentally two-digit numbers by one to two-digit numbers with products of 200. Lesson 1 After going through this module, you are expected to Multiply mentally two digit by one to two digit numbers with products up to 200 including money, mathematical problems, and real life situations. Hello kids! Today, we are going to study about multiplying mentally two digit numbers by one to two digit numbers with products of 200. Let's start our lesson by doing the following activities. Learning Task 1 Mentally calculate the products of the item. Number 1 64 times 10 Correct! 640 Number 2 86 times 2 Correct! 172 Number 3 15 times 6 Correct! 90 Number 4 37 times 10 Very good! 370 Number 5 54 times 10 Correct! 540 And now, let's move to learning task 2. Read and solve the problems mentally. Number 1. There are 17 pencils in every pencil holder. How many pencils are there in 3 pencil holder? Multiply 17 pencils times 3 pencil holders. Correct! The answer is 51. There are 51 pencils in all. Number 2. There are 40 5 peso coins in the box. What is the total value of the coins in the box? Multiply 40 pieces of coins times 5 pesos. 40 times 5 equals Correct! The answer is 200 The total value of coins is 200 pesos Number 3 A pile contains 15 books How many books are there in 10 piles? Multiply 15 books times 10 piles What is the correct answer? Correct! The answer is 150. There are 150 books in all. Let's analyze this problem. There are 25 baskets in the table. Each basket contains 6 mangoes. How many mangoes are there? In multiplication of 2 digit by 1 digit mentally, you may use the expanded form to find the product easily. For example, 25 baskets times 6 mangoes. 25 times 6, the expanded form of 25 is 20 plus 5. And the expanded form of 6 is 6. Now, let's multiply 5 times 6. 5 times 6 is 30. Then, multiply 20 times 6. 20 times 6 is 120. So the expanded form is 120 plus 30. The answer is 150. There are 150 mangoes in the basket. Let's move to learning task 3. 
Try to multiply the following mentally. Number 1, 48 times 2. Correct! The answer is 96. Number 2, 14 times 5. Correct! The answer is 70. Number 3, 33 times 6. Correct! The answer is 198. Number 4, 18 times 3. Correct! The answer is 54. Mental computation is very useful in your everyday living. Being able to compute mentally can save your time. It is easy to multiply number if one factor has a single digit and regrouping is not involved in the process. You can easily find the product for as long as you know the basic multiplication rules. And now, let's do learning task 4. Answer the given problems below. Ask your parents to use stopwatch while you are solving the given questions mentally. Number 1. There are 38 rows of chairs in the covered court. If there are 13 chairs in each row, how many chairs are there in all? To find the product, you are going to multiply 38 which are the rows of chairs, times 13, 13 pieces of chairs. What is the correct answer? Correct! The answer is 494 chairs. There are 494 chairs in all. Number 2. There are 18 baskets of pineapple in the table. Each basket contains 3 pineapple. How many pineapples are there? To find the product, you are going to multiply 18 baskets times 3 pineapples. What is the correct answer? Correct! The answer is 54 pineapple. There are 54 pineapple in all. Number 3. How much will it cost if 10 pieces of bread sold at 23 pesos per plastic? Multiply 10 pieces of bread times 23 pesos per plastic. What is the correct answer? Correct! The answer is 230 pesos. The cost of 10 pieces of bread is 230 pesos. Number 4. Anna shared her mangoes with her 13 friends. If each of her friends received 10 mangoes, how many mangoes did Anna have in all? Multiply 13 friends times 10 mangoes. What is the correct answer? Correct! The answer is 130 mangoes in all. Anna received 130 mangoes from her friends. Number 5. A box contains 15 pieces of chalks. The principal bought 13 boxes. How many pieces of chalks were bought in all? Multiply 15 pieces of chalks times 13 boxes. What is the correct answer? Correct! The answer is... 195 pieces of chalks. Kids, are your all answers correct? Wow! Good job! Remember, mental computation is very useful in your everyday living. Being able to compute mentally can save your time. It is easy to multiply number if one factor has a single digit and regrouping is not involved in the process. You can easily find the product for as long as you know the basic multiplication rules. Kids, I hope you learned a lot from this lesson. Until our next topic, bye-bye! Thanks for watching!